Welcome to Spotlight on Science here at Kansas State University. I'm Tony Williams. This week we talk to Dr. Jim Edgar and I'm Department Head of Chemical Engineering and University Distinguished Professor. Uh, Dr. Edgar is working on some really cool things. He's working on growing some really big crystals. House size crystals. <laughs> so maybe not that big, more like the size of your fingernail. He's using boron nitride which tiny bits of it are used in makeup. It's actually called white graphite. And Edgar's big crystals have three really big uses. The crystals could be used to make LEDs that would sterilize medical equipment or water without using heat. Right now, they use some really big light bulbs. They're very fragile and they use high voltage and they contain mercury, so people would like to replace them with something that's simpler. To make sure you got that, they're big, they're fragile, and they're filled with poison. Another cool thing about boron nitride is that of its optical properties, you can potentially focus it to uh, finer dimensions and get higher resolution microscope than you could previously possible. What we're trying to do is, is make a better neutron detector. The materials they currently make them out of are very scarce and they're growing scarcer and so the cost is, of those have been really skyrocketing. Most neutron detectors use helium-3, which is made when we make nuclear weapons. Which, think about that, maybe we should go back to doing that. Maybe not. Thanks for watching Spotlight on Science and thanks to our Spotlight scientist, Dr. James Edgar. Be sure to tune in next time. We're gonna have Dr. Amy Betts and Dr. Melanie Derby. And let me tell you, they're some pretty chill ladies.